Look, he's got some water in Mama's bed because he's so cute. <laughs> he just came downstairs. Kyle went up and got him from his room. It's like 8.30. And he wanted to crawl right up in my bed, put on a blanket, and drink his water in peace. And his favorite kind of cup. I, I was finishing my makeup for the day. I'm wearing like an undershirt right now. <laughs> my bra, that's it, because I don't want to put my real shirt on until right when we leave. I need to make a list. We go on vacation this week. And so I need to make a list of everything we need. She told me she's going to let Jack watch Scooby-Doo. She's going to let Jack watch Scooby-Doo? Oh, well. I guess that's logical. Jack's like, I don't like it. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Crazy giggle daddy. I'm just, I'm, just gonna, I'm just gonna put it to rest. I just got a comment on a video again. They were like, so Kyle wasn't happy on the reveal video. Were you happy about the reveal? Of course I was. Oh, that doesn't sound happy. That's not gonna prove anything. Well, I was, I was very happy. Yeah. You have a girl? Well, I was telling, I was like, Tyler and I were talking, and you watch the video because it's like the live stream is like kind of blurred. You can't see his face very well. He's like smiling the whole time. Like I don't understand why people, why some people were like, "Was he not happy?" I'm like, "What are you talking about?" Yeah, I was I really know. happy. I was gonna have a girl. I'm real excited. Yeah. I like anyway. my first girl. She turned out pretty great. Yeah, so. she did. So anyway, so, I also think it's rude to say that. Uh, like, who says that? Like, who goes up to someone and's like, "You weren't happy, were you?" Like, who does that? Like, that's so rude. That's tacky. Well, anyway. I know you're happy. Whoa. Whoa. Careful, little buddy. Thanks for laying on my laundry. I think it's more like, I think if anything, it's more like I didn't really, really care. Like, I like the surprise of it. But like, yeah, you didn't care if it was a boy or a girl. You yeah, were happy so either way. Just, so it was just like, yeah, you know, we know. I think I was, if I was yeah, happy he, about anything, I'm happy that we know. He was so happy. He's like, I'm so glad we know now. Like, it made him really happy. Because now we can actually start getting the buying the stuff, getting yeah. stuff done. Which okay. is important to both of us. Yes. Because with both the children, we, with Grayson, we were a lot better. With Sophie, there was too much last Whoa. minute. <laughs> Whoa! He's gonna choke on his water. <laughs> he choked himself on With Sophie, there was too much last minute stuff and it was stressful. Yes. And Grayson, there wasn't as much, but there still was a little too much. Yes. And it was our fault. Oh, so true. Like, like 100%. So we were like, this time, there's always some last minute stuff, but, but some of the stuff that was last minute shouldn't have been. Like, it's not gonna be this time. Like, no, we're gonna have everything bought by August. Period. Well, that. Everything. Oh, yeah. But I mean, like, no, we're doing all the big stuff even earlier, because well, yeah, August I will be, you know I'll be like almost nine months, I, well, I'm nine like, months pregnant at the beginning of September. We're just going to be sitting there when the baby comes and be like, yep, we got to swap for Yeah, I wanna, all I want to have to do is like the little stuff, or like a few like minor errands because we need some diaper cream, or pack the diaper bag, the hospital bag, or do some laundry. Like that stuff, it's fine. Everything else? <laughs> I love you so much. But yeah, he's happy, don't worry. Like. You know what? I think I think it's just because you didn't jump up and down like a girl like I did. Or Sophie. Or Sophie. Sophie too. Yeah. There you go, guys. There it is. <laughs> I taught it all in moves. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's like right here. My hack and cough and cold. That knock on wood, no one else in the entire universe got just Courtney. That's fine. I'll take that. Yay! So, uh, anyway, on a serious note, we were really sad about what happened in Oklahoma, weren't we, honey? It's horrible. It's horrible. Um, so you guys know, like, we're, uh, well, not, <laughs> I said we're, like you are, I forgot, you know? Um, uh, I'm from Oklahoma. That's where I was born, and that's where 98% um, of my family is in Oklahoma. So, um tornadoes are like a very real like fear factor I guess for me in my life um not so much here but for my family up there I mean it happens and um Kyle was it last year that the kids and I got caught in the tornadoes up there yeah yeah last year the kids and I and my mom we got caught in in tornadoes up there and it was really scary like we had to go to shelter I mean Grayson was so young and we, when we finally could go back to our hotel, like, 
we had no power and it was just it was just it's scary and I feel really um, I'm just so sad for those people but my family was not affected we have one my mom's cousin is um, we haven't been able to get a hold of her at least the last I heard and she was from this the town that actually got hit um, I don't know her very well but um, I, I'm, I'm assuming she's fine because they would have called me, so that was good. Let's go! Anyway, it was just sad. It just made me sad. It was like it hit too close to... You never want that to happen to anybody, but it was just like particularly thinking because my family's all there. Hi, Miss Sophia! You guys want some breakfast? Or is it too early? She's not wearing panties. Where are your panties? But I got stuck by a train here. <laughs> and I had to pick, it was like the morning, and I had to pick Colby Evan Beaumont from his friend's house. And I got stuck behind a train. And so I went, I saw cars like going to the right, and I'm like, oh, they know, you know, they're locals, they know, they know something. how to get around it. No, they just went up the road, and the train was still there. And it was like, <laughs> if the train looks like it's going east west now, you go up a road and somehow it's going north south and you cannot escape it. It just keeps going. So we're behind this train and it's like the weirdest train we've ever seen because it's just like cars. Oh, here's here's train parts. Actual train kind parts. of. Those are military vehicles. Yeah, it's and that must all I be think. military stuff. Look at that. That's so weird. Where would they be going? That or their Oh, well, I guess they could go anywhere. They're on train tracks. <laughs> <laughs> Some sort of base somewhere. Sort of military. That or like they're going, they're shipping what? those out for like safaris. <laughs> I'm not really sure which one. It's like there's, it never ends. You guys don't understand how much of this there was before I even started filming, wasn't there? You're yeah. my witness. Like, and see, the thing is, is like usually I'm feel just gonna like give going... up because there's like so many. I'm just gonna, okay. I'm and just gonna sit, settle in for the long haul. Alright you guys, so today we were running an errand, I guess you call it. Yeah. Like crap errand. I don't even I, we don't even know where his head is. <laughs> Poor guy. He so care. Kristen and I, it's just it's just shift. part of what you have to do, I guess. Like we we came out to get his um what did what do they even call that? The marker? The headstone. Headstone. Yeah. I didn't know if, because marker. it wasn't the like. Mark. I don't yeah. Know. Well, we came to get his yeah his little marker headstone ordered um, or at least figure it out. So we're here and we we realized that Kolb's he's not there's nothing marking him and so we <laughs> <laughs> we know nothing about flowers. we don't know any Colby knew more about flowers than we did so we ghetto rigged up some beautiful flowers for him. We staked him into the ground. Why are we and we, we don't even know. We, <laughs> this, this, this made everybody feel better. But we don't know if his feet or his head are. We don't know. He's laughing at us. Too. He, we, we, we're pretty sure he's up there laughing at us right now. Like, I can't even name what those flowers are. <laughs> I mean, I know carnations and an orchid. I don't even know what that is. This is really sad, but it's like. Yeah, until I mean, they, this is we wanted him to have something and they might remove them, but we figured it didn't matter. It's gonna feel better. It does. It's nice. Even if they're at his feet, he yeah. can <laughs> <laughs> It's so it's not funny. It's not it funny, but it is. <laughs> and the reason we knew where he was is that the his, his the old Italian grandma marked where he was. So yeah, this is what we were doing today, but we needed to get it's really pretty as long as you don't walk across the street. <laughs> we needed to get prices right and like just figure out what they had for markers or whatever. So did you want to look at some of the markers? So he has yeah. is that granite? Uh yeah, it's a granite base and what they were saying was we don't have to um, do the borders and stuff. Well we don't have to have the granite as a base even though Oh, oh you just can't previously what we did, but so, so this is his, his grandpa. Grand, yeah, that's his grandpa. That's a companion one. Yeah. And then his grandma will be buried with we're him not, next to him. Essentially, we're not really. Maybe they bury him. Like, could they bury him on top of one another? I don't know. I don't know how they do yeah. it. It's just it not is, that it matters. This is the kind of stuff you don't think you're deal with when you're yeah, 29. Yeah, strange. Like you don't under. No. But it's 
But there's so, his grandpa. So the benches he's, are kind of nice too. I, I know, I like the benches. Um, we don't, we don't know what we're doing. <laughs> <laughs> we're so awkward. <laughs> All yeah. these poor dead are like up in heaven. They're like, ugh. They're like, stop stepping on me. I don't know where you are. <laughs> we can't tell. <laughs> We're trying to be respectful. Um, and then there's like the lady that was like 104 or 102. Yeah, we found a lady who was 102 over there, which is really neat. So we got a lot. I think this is only the, um, I mean, like the third time I had to go to the cemetery. Oh. At his at his actual burial, I think. Yeah. yeah. Grandma. Grandma. And grandma and then grandpa. And uncle. Oh, Uncle Mark. Yeah. So this would have been the fourth time. Alright you guys. So Krista and I are back. We um <clears throat> we just had to go do that today so I didn't obviously film a lot during the day. I just filmed like when we weren't you know, in the mid middle of everything, but Kristen was so sweet. She was like, if you want to film today, I'm totally cool with that. She's like, if it helps anybody at all, she's like, it's worth it. Even if it helps one person see how you have to just do stuff like that sometimes. And it stinks, but it's just what it is. I had to wait for somebody to walk by. Anyway, so um, we're back and she dropped me off here. I have to, we have, Kyle and I have our um, um, optometrist appointment. So I'm waiting for Kyle to get here. And then we're gonna go in and get our eyes checked and then we'll go home and see the kids. There's Kyle. Kyle! <laughs> Hi, honey. I love you. Ready? I'm gonna get you. <laughs> 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 I'm gonna get you. 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 I got you. want your drink? I get your drink. Oh, choo choos. What color is that choo choo train? Is it green? Green? Can you say green? Gotta keep it in the air, huh? Gotta yeah, keep it in the air. Whoa! Whoa! He's there! Whoa! Whoa!
You want to take the balloon home so we can play with it at our house? Yes! Okay. Good. So she's, she's playing the don't let the balloon touch the game for and I was telling Kyle, I was like, I used to play that. And he was like, me too. I think every kid plays this game. So if you want to see what I got you? Yes. <laughs> Mommy made it hit your head with my magic powers. All right, I'm going to set you up on the table. Oh, my back. What she got? They are. They're water shoes for Galveston and Schlittermann. The kind you can swim in. Do you like them? Yes. Because your other ones were getting too small. So let's try them on and see if they fit, okay? And if they don't fit, it's okay. Here, let's do this one. Because I'm trying to itch because the tag is on. Yeah, but I'll take it off if they fit. Now, you see your knee? Yeah, that's my bruise. It's a scab. That's okay, it just means you play hard. It feels good. I like not even on. Water shoes are hard to get on. Ew. But don't worry, it's just because they're going to be snug with a... I feel good, Mom. Oh, yeah, they're not snug. That's just how it's hard to get them into that opening. I thought they were going to be tight. Oh, well, that's good, they've got that. Oh. The tag's not touching you. The tag's not even okay? touching you, honey. Okay, what do you think? Okay. Let's see. Let me it see. feels good. I want to make sure they're, they're not too small, honey, because they were... Oh, no. Yay, hey, Sophie. Think? You like them? Yeah. You like them? Okay. Now take it off. <laughs> now I can take off the tag so it won't hurt you. So you can use these to go to Schlitterbahn. All right. Let's get you water. Give mommy a hug and kiss. I'm gonna get you water. We'll play the balloon game some more. We'll play it some more, okay? Well, I just missed you so much. Did you have fun? Good. I love you. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Your fingers tapping on the table. Cookie mall. Cookie mall. Cookie at the mall? Bitch. What kind of cookie? Um. Big ones. A big, a big one? <laughs> and I will wait for 40 more until the last shot of the war.